we completed a very successful uh, conference on Kenya's uh, creative industries. The event heralds a new relationship be between government and Kenya's artists, writers, and creators. A number of resolutions were reached, and I will highlight those that the government uh, will take forward. First, it was agreed that this administration would oversee an unprecedented program to professionalize the entire creative industry. This follows from the need to recognize the talents and innovations that our creatives bring to the table. We need to create a structure that allows those talents their full expression, and the administration will make the necessary labor and tax arrangements for our artists, and it will also open opportunities for performance and exhibition of Kenya's creative work, while also arranging for commendations and other recognition of Kenyan cultural products and those who make them. That leads us to the second important point, which is that too often our artists have not had the venues they needed to display and perform their work. Uh, this administration, together with the county governments, will set up uh, a fund to reclaim theatres, social halls, and other public infrastructure for the use of Kenya's creatives. The third resolution is that government will help in the creation of local creative talent and that it will firmly enforce existing guidelines regarding the broadcast of, of that content. The aim here is to give Kenyan creatives a fair chance to benefit, to benefit from their creative work. These are uh, only some of the policy interventions to which we committed, uh, but in advance of the Youth Summit tomorrow, they show that the administration's commitment to the energy, the innovation, and the creativity of Kenya's youth is as strong as it has ever been.